What's up, YouTube? That's what beats back with another video. If this is your first time to the channel, is always welcome. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification button to get notified whenever I drop some heat. Okay, what we doing today? One of my subscribers reached out to me. He said, Yo, Daz, I just purchased the MPC Key 61 and I can't figure out how to put it in controller mode so I can use the DAW. Okay, the MPC Beat software. All right, so that's what we're doing today. This is strictly for beginners. I'm looking out for my beginners, man, because everybody got to start somewhere, right? So I'm looking out for y'all. All right, so let's go let's get it that's what we doing today how to put your no matter if it's the mpc one no matter if it's the mpc live the live two the mpc x only one we not going to talk about is the mpc touch because that's a midi controller right that can't go into standalone that or the the studio all right so let's go this is for how to Put your MPC in controller mode and how to bring it back out into standalone mode. All right. So let's go. We're going to do both. We're going to show you how to first how to put it in standalone and then how to put it in controller mode. All right. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's go. All right, so here we go. This is the MPC Key 61. Like I said, no matter if it's the live, the one, the whatever it is, all right? To put it into controller mode, wherever your menu button is at, you hit your menu. This right here is to bring it into standalone because I'm inside the software right now. So this button right here, this right here, is how you put it into standalone mode all right so you hit that it asks you do you are you sore switch to standalone mode you hit standalone right here all right so now Ooh. it's doing this thing is going into standalone mode all right once it's in standalone mode we do an empty project and whatever let's go to um main menu okay now i'm gonna show you how to get back out of standalone so we can go back into the software now so now you want to go back into the software the same thing menu and right here where it says mpc right here look like a little chip you hit that and it actually do you want to enter controller mode you do controller mode right there now is searching for the software Once it finds the software, now it pops back into the software, right? So let's go into the software and see where we at now. All right, so now we're in the software. Here we go right here. That's That was basically it. That's how you do it. Those two buttons that I showed you, that's how you get from standalone to controller mode and from controller mode to standalone mode. All right, let's go. Let's get it. I'll catch you in the next one, man. Let's go. Just a real quick video. All right, let's get it.